welcome, welcome, welcome everyone. This is Tracy Una Wagner with Versatile Inspirations and the Lightworkers and Earth Angels Academy and Study Hall. This is your weekly energy foresight for September 27th through the 30th. And this month, we have been taking cards from the Gilded Tarot deck by Ciro Marchetti. And what a wild ride September has been. <laughs> But as I promised, the end is much better than the beginning was. And this week, which is a short week, it's just till Thursday, we have the Ace of Swords. Yes, the swords again. But wait, listen what the sword, the Ace of Swords has for you. This is truly an auspicious card. Even though it is part of that earlier sword gang, this card is letting you know that you have triumphed over those challenges from earlier this month. Congratulations. This is a big win. You have proven your strength and courage more than once in September. This is your sign that success is yours. Booyah. So this ace is just letting you know you have aced it. <laughs> you have aced the swords this month. Oh my goodness. And your light is shining so bright, so brilliantly. That star from the beginning of September has really come so brightly into your life with so many tools that you can use now for any challenges that may come up, you totally have success through these swords. It is amazing and it's beautiful to see your glow shine so brightly now. Just be willing to receive all of the beautiful gifts of success that is yours at this time. So I've taken one card since it is a short week and I will see you again on Friday for the first few days of October, <laughs> which is my favorite month of the year. But I decided to take cards from the Ascended Masters deck, and this is by Hay House. So the one card that is for the 27th through the 30th is Energy Healing, and it is with Merlin. I love this card because we can do so much with energy healing and with that beautiful magician, Merlin, just know that alchemy is yours. You have a magic wand within that you can really tap in and work with, with energy healing. Your hands are beautiful healers. And if you or someone else needs just a little bit of a pep and energy shifting, just being able to energetically reach out and touch them. You don't have to necessarily put your hands on anyone, although by putting your hands on your heart chakra, you can really feel the healing presence of your beautiful energy. So just use that. It's very powerful. Even just thinking of people and just cupping your hands and seeing that person or thing or an animal within that space is beautiful healing for them. So just know that you can do that. You are a beautiful energy healer. We all are. It's just, is that your calling? Is that something that you want to do? Is that something that you're being called to do? Is that one of your gifts? If not, just place your hands on your heart and just allow yourself to fill up full with that beautiful, loving energy healing. All right, everyone. Blessings on ending September. You take care and I will see you again on Friday for our first few days of October. As always, I'm sending you and yours love, light, and eternal blessings. See you soon.